The marine industry is a highly segmented market with lots of key players around the globe, all fighting for their own niche segment of the industry. With such a highly segmented market, we came about with the first open reference architecture for the marine industry, namely MARSA, Marine System Software Architecture, in order to unite and integrate the entire industry above one platform. MARSA, as a reference architecture, is technology independent. This means that, per se, the reference architecture does not stipulate what technology should be used on marine vessels, but just states the concepts to be integrated on each vessel. You talk about two main architectures. We have the naval architecture, which has been more craft and is now becoming um, very deep science with the aid of software systems. And then we also talk about interior architectures. Until this point, it's fine. But then when we come to discuss the marine systems and software architecture, we see blank faces. And that's where the problem is. Because these three are fit together into a triangle. New architecture, interior architecture, and marine systems and software architecture. So being in a triangle, it means that if one of them is missing, then the final product is not as it should be. In order to showcase the power and flexibility of the Marsa reference architecture, we decided to go about using an optimist sailing dinghy so as to showcase the technology of board. I decided to name the Optimus Sailing Dinghy the demonstrator, as an actual fact is demonstrating the Marsa reference architecture. various front ends, ranging from an Ego tablet to an iOS iPad to Windows 7 Mobile.
sustainable by basically eating around dog food. This has helped us develop to identify the areas which needed further improvement in Marsa and other areas in which we were more successful. From today, Marine Electronics becomes a coordinator.